So why spoil the kids? Imagine you're five years old and you really want a pony. And you say, Dad, can I have a pony for Christmas? And you know you'll never get it. But then he actually shows up with a pony. And you're like, oh my god, it's a pony! And these kids in Mexico or anywhere else in the world that are orphans that have never had a dad to give them a pony before, they've never been told how much they're cared about, that's what Spoiler Kids is for. You need to go on and tell them, regardless of what the world is telling you, it's different. You are worth it and you're worth it all. And we're willing to spoil you immensely because we love you a lot. I felt like I was a kid in a candy store. We had all their gifts hiding in a room with balloons covered in them. They would pick up one and, is this mine? No. Is this mine? No. Is this mine? No. And I would just have to keep helping them. They started to rip it open like it was Christmas Day. Just being in the room, you could feel the joy of the Lord everywhere. It was an amazing feeling to be able to spoil orphans. We bought each of them little goodie bags full of candy. Uh, some of them had whistles, uh, bows, a bunch of different toys. When they got the toys, they were all so excited. They, they all wanted their picture taken with the Beanie Babies. We had uh, balloons, um, bubbles, chalk, face painting. They took glow sticks and they were just dancing around and they were pulling all of us in. Buckets full of water balloons and um, played different games like toss the water balloon and the water balloon waddle. Seeing the excitement and the smiles on these children's faces, it's the best thing in life. Mm -hmm.